Hello, today we will be discussing GMOs. What are they, and how are they made? GMOs, as defined by Dictionary.com, are genetically modified organisms whose genetic material has been altered by means of genetic engineering. This is done in order to make crops produce defensive toxins, like in beets and corn, or add vitamins as such with golden rice. We'll be focusing on GMOs in plant-based organisms, as currently we do not eat any GMO animals, though livestock is fed mostly by GMO grains. So, how is this all done? The process can be broken down into four steps. First, identifying a trait of interest. Second, isolating the genetic trait of interest. Third, inserting the desired trait into the new genome. This is done in a few different methods. The two most popular methods are the use of a gene gun that shoots the DNA into the seed of the plant, or by making a bacteria cell take up the DNA as a plasmid and having it infect the seed. Finally, the last step is growing the GMO. I think an easy way to imagine the process is like when a friend borrows a recipe for a cake. Your friend then goes to their kitchen and makes the cake. The cake is the same way that you or your friend made it as it comes from the same recipe. GMOs are just that. We are taking DNA sequences of recipes from one organism and giving them to another so they can make whatever the DNA codes for. This is possible because all organisms share the same universal genetic code. So backtracking to our friend Bt corn, Bt corn is a GMO variety of corn that produces the toxin Bt delta endotoxin, which is poisonous to the European corn borer. If we take the DNA sequence for the toxin from a bacterium known as Bacillus thuringiensis, the Bt delta endotoxin that is produced in our GMO corn is the exact same that the bacterium makes. Genetically modified organisms produce the gene product of their new DNA no different than how they process the original DNA. I hope this gave a brief idea on what GMOs are and how they are made. Thanks for watching.